This is an absolute monster. Hello guys, welcome back to TSVEC TV and welcome back to LRO 2018 and we are currently in the car park of LRO because as I said last year my car park video is kind of a show in itself, is it not? It is. And uh, we thought we would go for a little wander around the car park again, pick out some of our favorite. You weren't here actually last year, so this is new for you. I feel like some kind of judge at a <laughs> classic car show. We're well, not really, we're just two idiots in the land over car park. We're going to wander around, pick out some of our favorites and also look for stickers. So uh, we're going to see if we can find any TSPEC TV stickers with any of these Land Rovers. If we find one, we will be overjoyed, and if we don't find any, we'll be incredibly disappointed. <laughs> so hopefully we can find at least Just one, one. TSPEC TV sticker and pick out a few of our favourites. Starting off right here, we've got this rather nice Adventurer Edition Defender, one of the three final editions. And this is the kind of off-roady type one, and I think this is Chorus Grey. Comes with the nice wheels, roof rack and underbody protection. protection. We've got a storm tuning discovery right here with tough rock mud flaps as well. We've got the full set. We've got a heritage defender here, another final edition. So, just by complete chance, we've just come across this, which I believe is the tough rock project car discovery, too. As you can see, it's got the stickers. And I recognize it from their Instagram page because of the color, the mud guards, the mud flaps. Uh, these, I'm not sure what you call these side things. Um, yeah, so I'm pretty sure that is. The Tough Rock Discovery 2, which is rather cool. We just bumped into that by complete chance. So, Phil, if you're watching, we must admit, yeah, it is, okay. It definitely is because I recognize the number plate. So, Phil is around here somewhere today from Tough Rock, but we haven't bumped into him. So, I just said to Nissa, I really like the color, and he just said it's all blacked out, apart from the fact it's green. <laughs> yeah, now that you've taken your sunglasses yeah, off. It's green. Very dark. these rims. Really nice. Convoy of V8 is leaving here, including an ambulance. This is really, really nice. Bowler spec, or bowler bumper, bowler... Actually, I'm not sure if those are bowler or twisted wheels, but bowler bumper, bowler tree sliders or rock sliders, whatever you call them. And a really nice dark green colour. I was about to say that's like my dream spec, but then I have about 500 different dream spec <laughs> defenders, so... One of them. Yeah, one of them. Did not expect to see one of these here. And I'm not really sure what to make of it, but I'll just say no comment on that for now. Very nice new discovery over there in the distance. This is an absolute monster. Yeah, the bottom of the window is about the same height as my nose. This is cool. Really, really cool. Love a good 130. This is very cool. Just an old school Series 2. Bit beaten up. The nice colour, Union Jack, beige canvas, very, very cool. And then there's this thing, which is like a one and a half disco thing. Looks quite strange, but it's like a zombie thing. Zombie outbreak, there we go, zombie outbreak response vehicle with a bluish digital camel. Uh, uh, camel? Camo. Digital camel. camel. Zombie containment vehicle. It's actually got shutters in there, so maybe it's like a camper. Ah, oh, that could be, yeah. These are very, are these like baby zombies? Very small handprints. Baby zombies must exist. They must. Um, all the zombies must also be big chairs. <laughs> this, this owner has considered every type of zombie. Yeah. No discrimination here. Nope. Halfway through now, I think. There has to be at least one sticker, about halfway through the car park. So there can't not be a sticker in here. There must be a TSPEC TV sticker. And we will find it. Even if it's one, on the corner of a Land Rover somewhere. <laughs> what is that? 
And why is it here? Another storm tuning disco. Another adventure edition Defender right here in white this time. Not sure I've seen one in white before. This is a really interesting camo scheme that I've never seen before. Nissa, you're in the army. What kind of camo is this? Homemade. Oh, LSD camo. <laughs> well, maybe it's like a it's like a snakeskin thing, isn't it? It's got the uh, sawtooth alloys, which I love. Yep, and as Nissa pointed out, the Maasai windows. Quite a nice colour on this disco too. I like these chunky wheels as well, just sticking out from the arches. That one's missing an eye. Union Jack on the side of this one. Love a good Union Jack. It's missing there. Huh? <laughs> maybe he's in for buying one. Oh yeah, maybe this guy's buying a winch right now. He's got a winch bumper, but no winch. It's like a homemade Discovery 2 pickup. It's been camoed. It's got like a, it's just, just like a tray on the back of it. It's quite interesting. Oh, is it Tipper? Is that Tipper? I'm not sure. That's quite cool though. Huh. Here's a one, two, three, four colours. <laughs> quite like that, it's good fun. Okay, that's kind of amusing, it's like almost <laughs> matching on the same side. That's quite cool. I wonder what the story behind that is. So sadly we were not able to find any TSB TV stickers at LRO, which is a bit of a disappointment. There must be some somewhere. I mean, we didn't find any because we ended up just going and chatting to Club 86 Rages, but that'll be another video. So, uh, no, no stickers left behind us because we met so many people. Yeah. So, there has to be one somewhere in this. It is very windy now, so I don't even know if you can hear me. However, we did find some cool cars in the car park, and that was also the objective, so we did do that. So, that's another video from LRO this year. Thank you very much for watching. Hit subscribe if you want to see more content like this from TSBEC TV and hit like if you enjoyed and we will see you in the next video.